Sequentinental. Sequentinental? Oh. Sesquicentennial. Sequentinental? Sesquicentennial. Spanish? It's English. Oh, oh, <laughs> Sesquicentennial? Sesquicentennial? I think it means like sequel of a um, movie. Bravery, I guess. I don't know, something like that. It's quintessential to something. Some sort of number. On February 7th, 1871, the Board of Education of Fulton County, Georgia, under the direction of President Joseph Winship, met for the first time in the Municipal Courthouse of Atlanta. Their task was to build a system of free public education out of a collection of rural schoolhouses spread out across the farmland and forests surrounding the city. No one could have predicted that 150 years later, those first 13 one-room schoolhouses, those first 1,000 students, would have grown to include over 100 buildings, more than 90,000 students, and 7,500 teachers and staff today. The journey has been a long one, met with great achievements and greeted by many challenges. It is a history enriched by the many men and women, boys and girls, who have passed through its halls, sat at its desks, and played on its fields and in its gymnasiums. It is also a complex story, pieced together through the struggles of unprecedented change, the effects of segregation, integration, and through vast social, cultural, and technological evolutions. Throughout it all, one thing has remained. The schools of Fulton County are a reflection of the communities they serve capable, resilient, and diverse. Fulton County Schools has come so far as we celebrate the journey of 150 years where students come first.